Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about differential equation. So now I will show you how to answer. We put about bx equals to this one and q bxy and qsy. equals to this one in here so because we have dy so we need to do first the refer to of the function of b with respect to s so we just have only s in here first the refer to of s you got about number one so we have negative number three y square we have the s so we need to do first the derivative of q with respect to y. So we have y square and y to the power of 3 in here. First the derivative of y square you got about 2y number 2 with number 2 you got about 4. This one number 3 with number 3 you got about 9y square. So we see that this one is not equals to this one so we can use about transform into exact so so we see that we have y y square y square so in this situation i will put about integrating factor and that should be about mu y because if I put about mu y, we can simplify about y, y, and y, and later that we can find about integrating factor in here. So we need to multiply both sides by mu y. We know that we want to put about dp over dx equals to dq over dy. So this one is about the b over the s so we just concentrate about s only so you got about negative 3 y square multiplied by mu y about this one we apply about the product rule of the derivative so we do first the derivative of this one that's it from here multiply by mu y plus we keep about this one but we do first the refer to of mu y in here now we put this one go to the left So we have negative, we change the side of this one. So negative 3 y square plus 9 y square, you got about number 6. Next, we can do about factorization by negative number 2 y in here. Now we can do an another factorization in here. Now we need to simplify 2s minus 3y for the both sides. Next, we divide both sides by y square. Now 
Like that, we divide both sides by this one. Next, we put the interaction for the both sides. The interaction of this one, you got about ln of the absolute value of s. The interaction of this one, you got about ln of the absolute value of mu y in here. Now, I will put negative number 2 go inside about natural law in here. So we can get the final answer mu y equals to 1 over s square. Oh, sorry, y. I just made a mistake. 1 over y square in here. So after we got about this one, we return back to this one in here. So we multiply both sides by 1 over y square. Similar for this one. Now, 1 over y square with number 7 and 3s y square. Similar for this one. Now, I will put about B, S, Y equals to this one and Q, S, Y equals to this one. Now, we do first the derivative of the function of B with respect to S. So this one you got about negative number 3, similar for the next one. Oh, this is why I'm missing in here. So you got about negative number 3. And this is the, the technique to transform this one into about exact. And this is the answer for the question in here. Now, we can set up about the function fsy equals to the interaction of this one in here. So I will choose about ds plus 3sy, the interaction of 2s, you got about s square, the interaction of 3y, you got about 3sy. Next. We need to do first the derivative with respect to y. So you got about d over dy. First, the derivative of this one you got about zero. First, the derivative of negative three s y you got about negative three s plus d over dy three s y. And we know that everything in here equals to this one. Now we need to simplify negative 3s for the both sides. Next, we put the interaction for the both sides. The interaction of this one, you got about negative 7 over y. Negative number 7 over y, and we put about c in here. This one, you got about 3sy. And now we need to return back to this one. 
we need to transform 3xy into this one. And we know that everything in here equals to fsy. And fsy equal to c. Now we need to simplify and you got about c in here. And this is the final answer. This is the end. Thank you for watching.